This morning on our food segment called Today's Main Course, we're heading to a restaurant in the Warehouse District that specializes in Caribbean or island food with a New Orleans flair. It's called Nola K. Actually, the name says it all, Nola for the New Orleans influence and K, which means island. Nola K is a beautiful modern restaurant in the Warehouse District that opened in December of 2019. It was then forced to shut down three months later because of the pandemic. So while it's been around for a while, you may not be that familiar with it. Yeah, we're still flying under the radar a little bit, but I think that's purely just because um, we opened in 19 and then by early 20, everything was closed. So there wasn't really anything that was well known or happening in the city. We all had to do our part and stay home. Brooke Czar and her husband, Brian, have been in the restaurant business for years. They have another restaurant in Crown Point, which has a very Cajun feel. This one is totally different. Very different, very different, very different. This one is suitable to the area, right? We're um, not only in the warehouse slash CBD um, district, so everything's gotta be a little bit faster paced, a little bit more modern, a little bit fresher, healthier food. Um, we're also in the arts district of the warehouse. So um, we try to feature some of the more prominent artists in our area, um, and that's sort of our decor, our feel, because that's what suits this particular neighborhood and um, the folks that are here. Down in the La Crown Point Lafitte area, um, that suits us better there. We're a Cajun and Creole restaurants. We've got this beautiful Acadian style house that's right along the bayou. Um, alligators come up and we're much more focused on uh, wildlife and local Louisiana heritage there as opposed to New Orleans um, arts historical district here. Their restaurant in Crown Point is called De Fami, which is a very popular local seafood restaurant. They bought the place in 2009 and in less than a year, disaster struck there, the BP oil spill which was devastating for local seafood. Then in 2019, <laughs> you opened up a restaurant downtown called Nola K. Yes. And in three months? In three months, we're shut down for quarantine because COVID is here. <laughs> so you guys are batting a thousand. We are, we really are. <laughs> Uh, opening a restaurant and then having it shut down shortly after is certainly not new to us. But they pulled through with both restaurants, although bad luck hit again last summer. There was a devastating fire at Restaurant De Fami, which is closed while the restaurant is being renovated. That brings us back to Nola K, which after being shut down for a couple of months is now doing well. And that's no surprise. The place is beautifully done and the food is delicious. And so when you did a, a Caribbean menu, like what are some of the Caribbean dishes that, that you guys specialize in? Sure, so we make a fabulous, it's only a special, um, but we make a fabulous um, shrimp mofongo. That's kind of one of our specialties. But the ones that you can find most regularly on our menu now, we've got a phenomenal um, oxtail. We serve it with grits and grillades um, and a wonderful jus sauce. And then of course, if you're looking at brunch things, we do the New Orleans influence as well. So we've got our um, chicken, our southern um, chicken and waffles, but we do a jerk seasoning in our butter. So it's definitely a fusion of New Orleans things plus Caribbean. Uh, I mean, do, do you do a conch dish? We do, we <laughs> do have, you? we do. We've got crab and conch fritters. And we do it with a garlic lime mayo. That's one of our specialty appetizers. Brooke and her husband are apparently the eternal optimists. I couldn't help but wonder, after opening two restaurants that were forced to shut down because of a disaster, would you ever own another? Yes, <laughs> yeah, so maybe crazy three, enough as we are. Yes. Maybe three would be the charm? Maybe so, maybe so. Are you thinking about expanding? We are, we are, but it's all about finding the right concept for the right location. And, and so, that's really so all is, is that really in the cards now? Yeah, maybe so, maybe so, yeah. That's what we do. Um, my husband, it's, we're a husband and wife team, it's just the two of us. Um, we chose not to have kids, and we just love to work hard and play hard, so this is what we do. Well, maybe three times will be the charm. And I really do like Nola K. It's, it's, a, it's a great restaurant. Uh, it's great to go there for lunch because they're not uh, terribly busy during the lunch hour, which is, uh, you know, good for if you want to go to a place. Uh, but the place uh, I really want to try is the Restaurant De Fami down in, in Crown Point. That looks gorgeous on the bayou. They're still renovating that. It could be a few months before it's open again. Very nice. Yeah, I actually have eaten both of those, Eric. I usually am always like, I got to try the ones that you do. No, I know. was great. I had a lobster roll, and I tried day for me sometime last year. Yeah, but it is beautiful down there, isn't it? Gorgeous. It was such a beautiful.